good morning guys well good morning for me um it is tuesday the tuesday before christmas i would love to tell you that i'm all organized and i thought i was about a month ago and then quickly realized i am not i am not prepared for christmas i had to make a list last night where i decided that i was going to make a list of what all i need to do still and then more and more kept coming up i was like oh like in my list, in my little book of stuff, I have to get like loads of food still. And I've forgotten I need to put sausages on the list because I love sausages in my stuffing and I'm doing the Christmas dinner this year. <laughs> I'm even remembering things in my sleep. So I need to put sausages on the list before I forget Denny's cocktail sausages because they are the best. I don't know if anybody's interested to hear what I'm having for Christmas this year, but we're just having traditional turkey and then I think I might do honey um glazed carrots and parsnips and then i might do brussels sprouts with bacon bits bacon i need bacon it's a good thing i'm talking about this out loud because then i'll remember to jot it down i need bacon streaky bacon yeah and then i need to do my cheese boards my cheese platters so i'll go to m s for that i love their hummus they have this red pepper hummus so hopefully we get that this week and it's so it's my favorite hummus ever and then olives crackers chutney yeah then i just need to slur the fancy soft drink for the kids while i have my glass of wine because i will be having a red wine a glass of fino i've decided to go i don't really go glitzy but because we're in the festive season and it's like before christmas i brought these out today and then i'm wearing this little h&m cardigan and then just these top shop jeans i think i got them on asos last year and then these cute little slippers from they're so fluffy and i've been wearing them every single day because they're keeping my feet so warm they're alpaca wool and i think i mentioned them in my last vlogmas but they are so cozy so cozy gotta go turn on my christmas tree because i haven't done that yet i'm so behind this morning i left the girls to school that's better <laughs> that's far better i love all the lights all the festive lights and a little bit of ambience in the room so i left the girls to school um this morning and then elise off of the babysitters and now i would need to try and do some work so what i'm thinking of doing work wise today is i don't know if i want to do outfits today i kind of want to show people what i'm thinking of doing diy projects for the christmas table de bobbled this cardigan and i don't know whether you can tell but it's it was really bobbly and it's quite okay right now well like i think that's quite okay and uh, i use my little debobbler from amazon i got this on amazon so it has a few different settings so like three different settings it makes it go faster it um obviously debobbles everything here and then collects it in this little casing and it's rechargeable too which is great um i have to try i want to try the manual ones as well but this one so far i am liking so i'll try and link that down below in case anybody else wants it from amazon also i would love to get in with a hairdresser but it's far too late just to get this hair chopped but we're just gonna have to deal with this i'm gonna have to put a little bit of volume or maybe curl it today i'm not so sure i actually successfully managed to put a bow in my hair i'm so happy because usually i'm not very good at this kind of thing because my hair's really fine but i don't know what it looks like from the back but from the front from the front it actually doesn't look too bad wouldn't you know this is the way i have my hair styled today not for a day to go anywhere just for a day to sit around the house and create content i have a couple of pr packages that i still have to open first one i think is jewelry oh this is from rita grace and they're such gorgeous gorgeous girls and they have sent me a few more of their clasps thank goodness i actually use their clasps all the time they're these lovely matte colors and then they also do jewelry too but they're clasps i love the clasps these are very me very minimal like what i'm wearing in my ears is actually quite not me these are very me i will wear these non-stop throughout the new year full pair of everyday kind of they're almost kind of like huggies but like min like the mini bottega um that's, yeah they're like kind of like the mini 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 version of the bottega um earrings the eardrops that everyone wears oh another ring to the collection look at this one i love my rings if anybody knows me they know i love my rings i love the rita grace most of their rings i know of they're adjustable so it's great that you don't have to know your um ring size and then they'll kind of work for any fingers i'm so obsessed with rings that i love this one so much i asked pierce my present for christmas could he get me the gold one so i'm getting a gold matching one and then literally my 
pants will be full of rings and I will be loving life because they're my most favorite thing whenever it comes to jewelry. Also, we have another piece. It's another, it's another ring. <laughs> this is my day. So again, adjustable. That's my ring finger. I still haven't got a ring on the ring finger. So this is a little canvas bag and you could like wear it to the gym or just maybe in the summer as well. Bit of uh, last minute Christmas shopping maybe. I actually love the canvas bag. I think it's just the size of it and everything. I still can't get over it and I'm still so proud of myself for the bow. I don't know, are we wearing bows into the new year? We're probably not because I was like, maybe I should show you how I did it, did it but if we're not wearing bows in the new year then that'll wait till next year so i'm doing my wee bows for the glasses setting up here nice my uh diy bows and how to do them but it has taken me a full hour myself just to try and figure out how to diy to show everybody else how to diy the bows for their glasses it's fun i like doing festive stuff and because i'm in my bow era today just today I'll be sick of bows by the time I finish this. Drinking on the job? Not really. I just need it for props. Um, I opened this bottle of champagne that I think I've had for like six years. Not a champagne fan. And I thought it would go well just with the glass. Well, I just don't like wine looks good in these glasses. Um, here's my little bow I did earlier. It was just a simple little bow, that one. But the other little bow the fancy little one that i did that's content done i don't think i'm ever going to be a champagne girly so yeah i also did a little bow for my um candle this candle is skew with very lopsided <laughs> this table actually is extends so it's a round table now but at christmas it'll extend out a little bit and i might do little bows i think now around my um, candle holders, I've just ordered some from Amazon, so they should be coming this week. Keep us so, we are in the middle of cooking dinner tonight, together. The girls are having pizza, and then here's my, I think, are having chicken with peppercorn sauce and wedges. We miss our Hello Fresh news, because <laughs> yeah. they were so much easier. Cooking chicken. I'm so tired. Okay? You're tired. You need to get down from there. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. So some pizza for the girls. It looks re ow, really <laughs> yummy. That's our dinner sorted. There's a margarita. Finish off doing my These are our wedges. You have them in spy after we told you not to. Hey, you told to get that for dinner. Last minute, I decided to do some Brussels sprouts and bacon. That's like my test on for Christmas dinner. Okay, so I've tried to go down my lane and I'm not getting home. So that's how the vlog starting today, good morning, after leaving the kids to uh, school. I am just after walking through that windy, windy day. So a tree has come down on my lane. I'm having a chocolate for, <laughs> just for, just for um, trauma. <laughs> no, I'm just having a chocolate because I'm being naughty. But uh, yeah, I had a walk. Look at me, it's not that big a walk, but still I'd walk down the lane and I just wanted to drive to my house. <laughs> so if I've any shopping, I think it's more so I have to go shopping later and I have to bring the shopping back, which means I'm gonna have to carry the shopping five, 10 minutes down the lane. So it's not ideal at this time of year. I'm having a chocolate to soothe my feelings. We've got, got to get ready. Thankfully, I got the kids out to school before that happened. Yeah, it's actually better it happened when I was out. I don't mean stuck in the house because then I wouldn't be able to get out anywhere because there's no way to remove that tree right now. So I, like I said, I have to go and get my legs sugared. I have an appointment at 12.15 today. And then 
I have to go and pick up some presents. One for Pierce's godson, and then I have to get a couple of bits and pieces. I have to get food. I have to get Christmas food. A cup of coffee as well. I'm so drained. I need to get ready. I need to fix this look right now because this is not giving. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to wear these jeans, just for comfort more or less, but this is how much. I'm not gonna turn, I'm obviously I'm not turning them up like that. But I'm trying to figure out the length I need to cut them at. Cause I don't have time to sew them or anything, so we're just gonna go straight in. This is what I do with all my jeans. If they're too long, I just snip them off, snip the ends off, and that's what we're doing right now. Let's hope these are in not too short. I've got my dressmaking scissors, which haven't been brought out for a very long time. I need to do the other side, and I'm showing you now how I measure up the other side. Okay, so for the other side, it is as simple as just make sure we're even. I'm gonna lay down this piece that I already chopped off, and like literally lay it on top, and then I kind of know where I should cut from there. Hopefully, should leave them pretty more or less even. That looks good. Now I'm gonna try them on. Let's try them on, make sure they definitely fit. Okay. I think I took just the right amount off them because I wanna wear them on flats. I just did a little bit of filming there of my outfit today for Instagram and I just broke my clasp. I literally had it a day and I just broke it from Greta Grace. Greta, Greta Grace. I really liked it. I like this little like sort of khaki tealy color and I broke it. I've only had it in my hair for literally an hour or two. So that was great. My outfit deets today. This is confetti by Ja and I got this little hat a year, two years ago I'm gonna say. And then my Rita Grace earrings and then this red top from Naked because I love red and it's got this cute little um, lettuce edge detail at the top and on the sleeves, at the neck sorry, and on the sleeves. My mango jacket, my H&M um, jeans that I've just cut, my Birkenstocks and then I've got my Rita Grace bag for doing deliveries. The shopping, aka I have to leave some stuff back, so this is great for that. And that's my little outfit of today. I need to go, and then we can go see the the branch or the big tree and see if it's still on the road as I walk up. Oh, I can't be bothered walking. I'm so lazy. I know I can't be bothered walking up my lane. So currently walking up this lane, I'm getting rained on. Great. I knew I needed a hat anyway because of the wind, but um, probably needed an umbrella too. I'm so out of breath. <laughs> I needed more exercise. January 2024 though. This, this is me. This is us. Oh, I'm gonna have to, okay. Slowly but surely getting rid of it. Oh, I'm gonna end up getting moss over me okay this is just this is awkward can I climb over it? no or under it? no okay we're in the other side so that still hasn't been moved since this morning and um yeah now I have to go to my leg sugar appointment so I just have to get my leg sugar the time is packed it is packed i've just waited my time because whenever i came into the car park there was no car parking spaces free but i just waited my time waited my time and somebody let me have their space and then also some other girl was leaving too she left me a car parking ticket that has a couple hours on it so this is the time of giving merry christmas everyone is so so sweet but now i have to go leave my stuff back okay i'm back in the car um cadence's school is doing a food bank so the last cutoff day is today. I've just literally done some shopping for the food bank. Hopefully I haven't missed the cutoff date for that because I want to try and get that in and I have to go pick up kids. Also, I'm going to see if I can give my ticket to someone else that is parked up. So slowly try and find somebody because it's got another couple of hours on it and the feeling of festiveness. You want to pass that on, the good feeling of festiveness. I love Christmas. 
I am out in the car again. And just in case anyone was wondering, did I meet the food bank? I did. So I got the stuff left in to get into school. Then we went to my mum for a cup of coffee. And then I also found somebody to give my ticket to as well. So it's been like literally in the car all day. Nothing fun happening today. Um, Tomorrow? What am I doing tomorrow? Oh, tomorrow I have to go visit my friend though and I'm going for a coffee. That'll be nice and grabbing some plates from her. And then I think I'm going to go make a garland with my mum in the evening time. So yeah, um, just come along with me shopping to M&S now. So here comes Shauna shopping. Who is it the rule is? You go shopping on a full stomach and then you don't uh -huh. have to buy as much. I'm going to end up buying nothing. I'm like, <laughs> 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 Thursday morning now. I have just uh, left Cadence to school. I need to dry my hair. I need to dry this crazy hair. Um, I left Pierce last night, obviously, with the girls because um, my lens. What is wrong with my lens? Um, I left. So I left Pierce with the girls last night because Shauna and I were shopping, doing the shopping, doing the food shopping. And like he didn't bother picking up a single thing. So my house is a mess, but I have to go now to the port slash cool rain. Meet up with my friend Christina, who has a brand called Rose and Rain, because I have my dinner plates, um, Christmas dinner plates. I want water. Okay, I'll get you water now. So these are my Christmas dinner plates. Um, Rose and Rain, like I said, my friend's brand. And I have to travel with cool rain because I left it too late to order these online. Um, to finish off my full set for Christmas, the Christmas dinner table. This is me. This is my life. I always leave everything too late. Last minute. I thought I would be organised this year. Nope. This is my school run outfit, and I think I might go a little bit more um, dressed up for the coffee. I'm running late. I should have been actually away half an hour ago. <laughs> I need to speed this process up. I'm thinking of bringing out a little bit of sparkle. Cute. If you don't like too much and like minimal stuff, then this is in the color. In the color, I don't know. <laughs> I think it's shell. Okay, we're wearing red again. Elisa's come with me to Cold Rain. We're in Cold Rain now. Um, this is not the outfit that I want to wear. It's actually an off the shoulder top, but I'm wearing it as like um, a, a turtleneck. Black trousers. I got Uggs on because they're cozy. It's the season of red. We're going to the Barn Door Cafe in Cold Rain. Hey, and we're going to meet Christina Christy. and Olivia. And Olivia, and you can have me play date with Olivia. Yeah. Yeah. You're just so gorgeous. <laughs> Olivia's got her hot chocolate. Are you happy? <laughs> Let me see what the star says. It says it's written in the stars. Written in the stars? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what I have to deal with. <laughs> Elise, get up. Come on. Look. Elise, up. Okay, so we're down to the hall. <laughs> Are these little glasses for the girls for the Christmas table? So cheap if they smash them, that's okay. But they're for Christmas, the Christmas table. And these um, tea towels.
Okay, I'm eating, eating again. I got a festive KFC box meal. Supposed to go to mom's yesterday and get the garland. That didn't happen because the weather was that bad. It was like storm weather, so that didn't happen yesterday. Um, hopefully it happens this evening. But right now we're away to collect our turkey and our ham and obviously getting a bite to eat the place is mental at the moment. So we we're like, we're not going to be able to stop in the shop. So we just get KFC drive through because it's quiet. I got a Singer Burger, it's my favorite. Love spicy. Pierce doesn't, so he's original. So they're getting Patrick, Robo Dog. And then the girls are having one final look around. This is where we're eating our Christmas turkey and ham. We got the last bit of shopping done yesterday with the girls. Today is Saturday, two days before Christmas. So I think I think everything's done. Just need to do wrapping. I'm heading to my mum's today because we're gonna finally she cut some branches and I'm gonna get um the garland done for my Christmas table. Also decided to do my hair wavy today, which I like never do. It's always straight. So today is like a little girly day. I don't know if I like it. I'm just not used to like this. I don't know if I like it, but today is a little girly day with my mum. And yeah, we're gonna make the garland together. So that'll be fun. She wants to do something. Um, she wants to do like an activity type day and then a glass of wine take out tonight. Yeah. So I'm not even wearing anything, like it's two days before Christmas and today is the day I decided to go more casual and less Christmassy but I want to be um, comfy and I think I've worn all the red that I can get in this week. So all we're going to do that might be slightly Christmassy, maybe it's not even. I got a little package from ASOS, got these, I got little heart earrings, finally I know everybody has them but I finally got myself a pair, they're okay, I don't know if I like them. <laughs> These are the ones I was wearing the last few days um, from Rita Grace. So I'm going to swap them today because this outfit's very plain. And put on these chunky earrings. That's them. Maybe they're kind of cute for this festive kind of kind of look. I just don't like. I just don't like my. I love my hair just straight. Yeah, but. This is what we're going for today because this is what I did. <laughs> this is what I'm wearing. Quite like blue jeans and then a polo neck top. These little earrings obviously and I might get a pair of silver heels to like, you know, mishmash with the, the gold. So these are my little silver shoes that I've worn to death already. I'm wearing them, the heels. And I'm also bringing my slippers with me so that I'm comfy while I'm making my table garland. I'm about to show you what I actually got the other day in TK Maxx and uh, Donnell. Rose and Rain, my friend, Rose and Rain. These are to finish off my Christmas table. Okay, so just some more of these plates, but as well as these plates, Christina was so kind. And she gave me a little Christmas present. She gave me this little bowl that is part of the Tatiana collection. So I cannot wait to, um, yeah, have some porridge or something in this. And I'm so, like, I am just so happy now. I have like literally, apart from side plates, I think I have nearly everything from the Tatiana collection. Love, love, love her stuff. And if you haven't checked out her homework stuff, I will leave a link down below and you can check that out. Then I stopped in. I haven't got any like Christmassy tea towels this year. So I went and got some Christmassy tea towels from Donnell. And I'm just gonna use these for Christmas day so that I can use them next year again. Napkins. Elise actually picked this up, but this is gonna be great for my pavlova trying to get the egg whites out. And it was down in sale to £2.50. Dog on it. And I got this oh, so cute. It's so cute, little Christmas dog. Picked up these glasses. So I That's have mine. wine. Yeah, this is yours. So I have wine glasses for the Christmas table for us. And then I decided to get these little cheapy ones for the girls as well. So they could kind of feel like they're drinking in something fancy. My glasses are actually my mum and dad's wedding presents. So they are crystal. 
so I just can't have them like they cannot get smashed they can't they're like a family heirloom at this stage um so then yeah I got the girls so they'll feel included with their own little cup Mom, and these were £3.50 from Donnell my, my uncle has a dog so I got him a present but then also I got his dog this cute they live in the country so I got his dog from TK Maxx this cute little coat little sort of peggy toy for the dog with a squeaker it's kind of like a big massive baby toy that's that's the way I see it. Her um, dustpan brush is broken in a bit. So I got us a new one. And it's kind of like a pinky natural kind of color. And then this like little soft bristle brush. And that was $6.99 for that one. Then from Amazon. So I, again, for the Christmas table. I'm sure plenty of people have these. But I ordered these. They're three different heights. And that will be for the centerpiece in the table. And then I got some candles. I decided last minute to grab some white ones so hopefully they fit. Let's see. No, don't put the sand in it. Don't put that back in it. These are my candle holders and my candles. And then the girls got a new night light. Here's the night light. I see it. It's like a little angry kitten. So now I have to wrap up the Christmas present for the dog. <laughs> but my whole family knows, everyone knows how bad I am at wrapping. And Pierce will probably have to do the Christmas wrapping like for under our tree because this is one I from my mom earlier looks lovely here this is it behind like I have no patience for wrapping we'll look at this and be like Ashley but <laughs> let's see how it goes wrapping my, my uncle's presents here's my wrapping and then the kinetic sand mess in the background I hate kinetic sand but Kind of like not the best, but okay from the front. <laughs> this is <laughs> That's the best I can do. Okay, so we're in mom's, and here are the branches that she's cut down that we're going to decorate for my um, little garland for the table. And these are little bits and pieces that we have as well cinnamon, fresh cinnamon, I think that's fake holly, and then we've got some. Real holly in here. I don't know what these are, but yeah. So it's a little bit chilly. So mommy has given me her cardigan that she knitted herself, by the way. So we're in that, and then we're gonna get started into making this little table garden. Here's my big branch that I'm gonna start with, and then here's mom helping as well. <laughs> Okay, it is Christmas Eve and we are about to make some cookies for Santa tonight. Making some cookies and decorating them. I got Elise with her Santa hat on, my Santa hat on. I'm kidding. Listening to Christmas songs in the background. Okay, so here's our dough. These are our little cutters that I got from Amazon. And um, got a few different ones there. And then Cadence, so we've just rolled our dough. <laughs> yep. Okay. We've got our little reindeer outline. It's like mine. Let me see it. Wow, so pretty. Is it yummy? Delicious. He's beat already. Christmas Eve. Who's ready for Santa? Me. We're ready for Santa. Me. <laughs> this one's ready for Santa. I had a phone call from Santa, and Santa said he's coming to our house now, didn't it? Kins has said we need to go to bed. We need to go to sleep right now. Because Santa only comes whenever we go to sleep, doesn't he? Yeah. So. Yeah. I want him to come to ours first. <laughs> you want him to come to ours first? He was in Spain, wasn't he? Delivering to all boys and girls over there. And we were not in Spain. No, we don't live in Spain. So you can say night night to everybody and see you in the morning. Night night. Night night. <laughs> okay, so the girls are fast asleep now. Thank goodness, finally. Um, Pierce is at the wrapping station. Because he wraps better than me. I can't wrap presents. The only fancy schmancy bit I can do is the decoration of the parcel, so I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> Just 
plastic stand in the table for Christmas dinner and then I'm gonna set it up. So I'm in the middle of cooking dinner. I don't know, I don't know how it's going. I'm stressing a bit. I have not, I think what, half one. I haven't got my makeup on yet, but my forehead's very shiny. I don't know if that's stress <laughs> from the cooking or that's natural glow. Anyway, got our Brussels sprouts. Parts right, ready to go. Um, potatoes are par boiling. Turkey is in the oven. I just hope it all comes out in time. But anyway, I need to set my table next. I think the table is done. These are the rosemary and plates, DIY garland, bows on the glasses, ready for Christmas dinner. I'm filling up my glass of wine because cooking dinner was uh, stressful. So I also made pavlova, which I didn't record. I didn't even record our dinner because I have been flat out. A strong way. I'm watching some Jumanji, some Christmas films, and then I'm gonna finish off doing my pavlova. Dinner was like a success. It was very hard doing it on your own. <laughs> this on. Good girl. I decorate this. Yeah, you're decorating it. Well done. Can I yeah. Another helper. Strawberries. Good luck, kittens. <laughs> 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 Getting very close to the Christmas tree. <laughs> it is a boxing day. I was literally shattered last night because, yeah, that was just mental. That was a mental, mental day. I've spent all this morning tidying and cleaning up everything. So that's that done. My dad has come for a little cheese board for Boxing Day. And I'm gonna get into something comfy. So I'm in my Christmas Eve PJs again. I'm going to, I'm gonna open up my Arquette parcel. This little jumper, especially for Boxing Day. Oversized and cozy kind of knit. And this is, has got like a, what do you call that? Cable net. I'm gonna get my cheese board ready and get some makeup on this face because I just I feel like we need some makeup plus I broke nails yesterday. That's how much work I was doing. Okay, so this is the knit. I actually really like it. Really nice design, really cozy. I'm wearing a little like white top underneath it. But yeah, this pair of leggings and my little fluffy slippers. That's my boxing day outfit. Mm-hmm.